What's the thoughts? Bro, let's go. Get up. You make me so. So, about to hit this run. As you can see, just been trying out my gimbal, and that's why everything is so smooth. Gonna hit this run. Um, probably gonna cross over the bridge into Kentucky, into Covington. Feeling good. Hope that's not a storm. And here we are passing from Ohio into Kentucky. Yeah, so apparently I did it. That was really nice. Uh, this is before I was feeling the pain. So after I do the bridge into Covington, I'm probably gonna flip back around and then run back into Cincinnati. And at that point, I'm gonna see where the Bears play and where the Reds play. All right, so I'm a dummy. And uh, accidentally hit unrecord when I was recording where the Reds play. So uh, here's a clip of that now. And um, here's a clip of what I accidentally recorded. Just my feet bobbing up and down. Oh good, so I did that too. That's, that's amazing. And then after that, I'm just gonna probably run back to the hotel here and be super sweaty and ready to take a shower and finally eat my first meal of the day. So uh, I'm gonna snap you into the future right now. Whoa, and here I am. See, how was that story? I told you, now I'm back. I did all the things that I said I was gonna do in the future, except now I look eight million times as sweaty. You might even see me in the mirror behind me. Um, but yeah, today's a day off in Cincinnati. And on today's day off, I think I'm gonna work on music, but I really don't think I'm going to do anything crazy today. So instead of bore you on this day off, I'm just gonna uh, slide into the show day in Cincinnati. What's up from Cincy? We are out here the same place that we were for the Endless Summer Tour. And I'm walking to find everybody to play this EP. Thank God that we have that fan account, shout out to JT and Jalisa, for me to contact everybody because it has been pretty tough to figure out these spots. Welcome to Cincinnati, lots of cool stuff. Before we really get started though, check out my drone in the sky. Uh, so we found our little pocket of shade here. Not where it was on the map. Thank God I didn't walk out there. Um, yeah, but isn't it all like ticketed? It's not ticketed? Do we want to take a field trip? Yeah, a field trip. Got the old path on. Hey, I worked on that, all right? You built Don't it? Don't hate on that. I no, worked there, bro. It takes two operators to operate that beast, bro. Hey, since when? 1893? Since like, yeah, probably. Shout out the Python, the very first roller coaster ever. Listen to that baby purr. Look at the whole squad and trail. Yeah, sorry, I walked really like New York City fast. So today, today isn't bad though, because I have on the uh, Crocs. As much as I joked on them before, they're actually really comfortable. Don't tell anybody I said that. Don't publish this. But if you do publish this, please give me a sponsorship. Croc, sponsor me. Thank you. Yeah. What's up, squad? Hey. I feel like this is like a really big group, but I feel like it's very intimate because we are all very comfortable in this nice little space. But I'm gonna turn the camera off now. We're gonna get reactions after the songs because this is my squad now. And then something at the end. There's number one. Bro, let's go. Get up. Let's go. Oh my God. What's the thoughts other than? Relating to me, it felt like you were talking to me like in my head. I don't know. That's amazing. I think that the preface that you gave beforehand was really interesting and I yeah. think I started connecting the dots. Um, I think that what I started seeing was what exactly those insecurities were. And I know for me at least, the general theme was like getting or not getting like confirmation or acceptance from others. And I know that I like, recently went through a breakup and so I initially like connected it to like a romantic relationship but when I like took a step back I was thinking this could really be from any relationship whether it's someone in your family or a friend so like when I was listening to those I was listening to your words and you were saying like 
I get that's like your emotional state, but I feel like when you hit that, because you make you make the music, bro. Uh -huh. When you hit that, like I'm talking no words. When you stop using the words, when you hit that beat and you like, oh, when you bring all of that coming after that like emotionalness, I feel like that's your way of speaking, bro. When you feel that, like it's like, and like, and like with the, how it got more somber at the end and like the more clicking and stuff, it was like. That's like your way of talking in a way, and it's like, like a lot of people get it from the words people do. I don't know. I just feel like you coming off. That's why I really respect that song, cause it's like you were saying all that, but like your reply was that like, hey. That's it. Hey. Yeah. What's what? What are thoughts, dude? It sounds like the progression to the biggest boss fight of your life in a video game. That is how it makes me feel, and I'm internalizing it right now. Right here, right now? Right here, right now. And I'm just going through that whole sequence in my head, and it's honestly fucking crazy. It, it, even when you're not speaking, the, the, the instrumental just speaks for you. Yeah. And it says more than words could ever say or process or that your mind could ever think of. And I, I, I really appreciate that. Well, thank you. You sound like a marriage. Gosh, there's a beginning, a middle, and an end. <laughs> oh my god! That's even... <laughs> Wait, you know I have neon shoes. Should I wear them tonight so we can match and get a picture? Okay, cool. My mom has her home screen. <laughs> oh, has the neon shoes? Yes! Dude, the way you like, the way you produce your music, bro, it's like for people who don't, who, who love music, but like, who like, the music, the instrumental part, bro, like you're just speaking like paragraphs. This guy, these guys are both agreeing with me, bro. Like, oh, yeah, you're cool. like, yeah. you're making me like, oh, like I'm getting like butterflies in my, I don't know, my music, I don't know what the, the fuck I'm saying, my music stomach. And your my, music organs. Yeah, my music organs, bro. Like, it's something about it, bro. You're good. Yeah, your chord progressions and the way that, like, they just fit with your song so well. And I also, I love dry bass, so black and yellow, the way you use, like, the dry triplet basses. Oh my gosh. I love dry kicks for some reason. They just hit me right in my feels for some reason. Oh, just wait till you get it in the headphones. My favorite thing is how some of the lyrics have, like, double meanings. Like, mm -hmm. that's, like, what I geek over. Like, I listen first song to last song because. There's songs that always have like a fade into the next, and I know mm -hmm. it's that a couple of times in yours. I love that. But then on top of it, like talking like yeah. you're literally yeah, sitting on the couch next to me, like actually like just having a conversation is what it makes like takes it to the next level. Like we can still apply it to like whether it's friends, relationships, family, like jobs, like school, whatever. Like it's still applicable to like what everyone. But that's what I'm saying. It's like I am not. I'm not special. I'm not a, there's no holier than thou, anything. Like, if you really want to, it could be anything. If you want to go ride horses, you want to jump horses or whatever you want to do. If you are that determined that you're staying up at night looking at YouTube videos like, how do I buy a horse? How do I train horses? How, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. You're going to be great. By a show of noise, how excited are we for the EP to come out? Yeah! Okay. And that is it here in Nasty Natty. Yeah. We are good to go. Um, about to perform tonight. It's pretty warm. Got some crazy drone shots. Don't know what else I'm gonna do today. Whatever I'm doing, we're just gonna slide on into it. One, two, three, slide. There's a small portion, a medium portion, and then there's just guilt level portion. <laughs> Maybe if I just gather some groats together and throw it on the plate. It's not like I actually ate it. Man, I'm trying to turn it. <laughs> Maybe if I spread them out, mom and dad will think I ate all of my food. The guilt portion, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, presented by Raina Zimmel. There's chocolate in this, all right? This is chocolate and pecan pie. Oh, right? no, I can see. You spread it out. All the ingredients are separate. <laughs> I'm trying oh. to turn my insecurities wow. into art, but I can't, man. I just want you right here, right now. Honesty don't always hold. I know that you gotta miss it somehow. Right next to you and back. Now we're lying to ourselves. I just want you right here, right now. But I keep it to myself. Honesty don't always Fine girl, you make me so. I want a shelter, a roof over my head I 
call her to my name